What's going on YouTube? It's Gavin. I'm here with another reaction video for you tonight. So, we have Two Faced by J. Cole. This was a request, and I promise I am getting to the request. I got to some recently. I, I'm trying to get to everyone. I'm trying to get to everyone. I got you guys. You don't got to worry about that. Now, J. Cole, he's one of my favorite rappers. I've heard all of his albums, but... I haven't heard much of his mixtape material, and this is a song off his mixtape, Friday Night Lights. So I actually have not heard this song, so I saw that, and I was just like, you know what? I gotta go react to this, because I love myself, uh, J. Cole. So, let's get into it. Two-Faced by J. Cole. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Let's go. Hey, I got a dollar in the train. J. Cole says that a lot. Got a dollar in a dream. Keep in mind, J. Cole, he came from nothing. Just a small town that wasn't the best town in North Carolina. And now look at him. It's, it, it's an inspirational tale. Spot, hey. Yeah, the middle state of a young black teen is conflicted. The fast life I done seen on the screen is addictive. Money and clothes I done dreamed about. And all the hoes that I think about. They tell me, am I wrong for visualizing material shit I never had? Waving gaps instead of flat. And that, that, that also reminds me. Uh, J. Cole has mentioned in his music before how he came from nothing. In that town in, in uh, North Carolina. And he was always dreaming about... Being big, about blowing up, about being successful, about getting out of poverty and helping his mom. That's just J. Cole. Ask the American dream, why do we cling to the villains? Knowing they kill him, my niggas high enough to swing from the ceiling. Ink from the pen, spilling on my notebook. Filled with dreams, this is my hope book. Steal the screens from little girls, shot and killed. Fill my head on the daily. At times I question God, can you blame me? They can't tame me. My voice screeched through the streets. I'm and J. Cole, I, I, I'm sorry to pause it so much, but I'm just so into this, man. I love J. Cole. Um, and J. Cole, he has mentioned before his, his struggle with his faith. Along with many other artists, one of my favorite songs on that topic is These Worries by Kid Cudi and Mary J. Blige. I highly recommend listening to that song if you haven't heard it. It's about struggling with uh, believing in the faith. It, it, it's a very deep song. It's a very deep song. I'm a beast on him. Oh no, he will not fold. You will not see a crease on him. He will not slip or lose his grip. They got them cleats on him. But never will he run unless you call police on him. Two yeah. times, three times. Slip, cleats. Got cleats like football cleats, soccer cleats. They got the they got the grip on the bottom so you don't slip, so you don't fall. He always comes through with the bars. Sorry I'm pausing it so much, guys, but whew, J. Cole always comes through with the bars. Sometimes I scrap, sometimes I'm throwing up the peace sign. It's two sides to a nigga, though. I said it's two sides to a nigga, yo. Hey, look, sometimes I'm feeling high, then I'm feeling low. Low, will I die? Will I survive? Let a nigga know. You say you know me, but what side did you get to know? It's two sides yeah. to a nigga, yo. Yo, yo. Yeah. Some that reminds me. Have you guys seen that, uh, the, the show ba uh, Big Mouth? on? Uh, it's on Netflix. <laughs> the latest season with the doc. Uh, but yeah, the, not everyone's the same person all the time. It all depends on who you're with. It, it depends on a lot of things. But there's more than one side. There's more than one face. Pussy niggas put out on me and my mans. Wasn't for the pistol, we drop them right where he stands. But still, we never ran. Foolish pride made us stand right there. Not understanding we could lose our life there. And then it hit us, thinking about the close calls from long distance. Uh, as little niggas in the field, we was tripping. Type of nosy ass niggas to watch the fight until it's over. They ran when the gats came out. I moved closer. Foolish, what was I thinking? Wasn't trying to be coolest, just a thrill of the danger. Get so filled up with anger when a stranger get the violating. He sleeping on me wide awake, but y'all annihilate him. I'm tired of waiting on my ticket out this motherfucker. Hope they don't kill me for I get up out this motherfucker. I gotta go. Now, could I be that nigga I thought I was? I gotta know. Will I make it like I thought I would? I gotta blow. Hey, One time, two times, three times. Sometimes I scrap, sometimes I'm throwing up. That's the thing. You, especially when you're in the hood, 
when you're in the hood, you can't be doing that shit, man. You, you, you got to be careful on who you confront. You never know who's strapped. You never know who has a gun on. You never know. You could you could confront someone and start shit, and then that's the end of your life right there. I see people try to confront people all the time. It's like you don't do that, especially if you're in this in the like, you know, Syracuse here. Don't do that shit. <laughs> yeah, I, I see people here do that all the time. I'm thinking. There's a lot of gang violence and shit here, especially in the city, especially when you get more like to the, like the north side, south side, all that. Oh, you're from the south side. Boom, boom. It, it's literally like that. So it just you, you can't confront someone over some dumb shit because it, it, you could ease, you can lose your life in a second. The peace sign is two sides to a nigga, though. I said it's two sides to a nigga, yo Hey, look, sometimes I'm feeling high, then I'm feeling low Low, will I die, will I survive, let a nigga know You say you know me, but what side did you get to know? It's two sides to a nigga, yo yeah. I yo. seen heaven, yo. seen hell yo. The two faces of the veil One side dreams, the other side's real One side schemes, the other side deals With what the pain brings, another mother cries still Why the fuck am I here, God? That nigga died, and why the fuck am I still alive? I feel ashamed cause the good Lord, the brother is Yeah, you know, I've I've lost so many people due to young age I've seen, I've been to funerals where the parents are crying over their kid's body it's it's fucked up, but I've been to way too many funerals where the parents are attending their own kid's funeral. And right there, that's another thing that can make you question your faith. Success to me, and all I seem to focus on is all the stress on me. Blessed homie, we breathing. Cold world got me sneezing. Wrote this when I was broke, so hey, I guess we even. Though it blows, fighting demons, trying to stop from busting semen in an unfamiliar bitch. I know my niggas feel this shit, how could I fuck her wrong? And I just met the hope, my dick took over, it ain't never felt this wet before. I'm stressing in my mind, but it's way too late to stop it. Made this shit so bad, I had to count them in my pocket. Let's change the topic, before I go berserk, I'm so alert. Riding down 95, now I ain't finna go to work, I'm headed back home. Ain't staying that long, I'm chasing dreams, shawty, I'm paying back loans. I'm paying dues that a nigga paying tax on. I'm trying to blow like a nigga playing saxophone. I'm playing daddy to another nigga daughter. Don't worry, even Jesus. <sighs> trying to blow, saxophone blow up, saxophone you blow into a sax. <sighs> J. Cole always comes with it. Um, And I've driven on 95 too. I've driven, I lived in Florida for a little bit. Uh, when I'm before I moved back to uh, Syracuse, but uh, you take 95 from Florida up through like North Carolina and such. So I driven on that same highway even through North Carolina. That's crazy. Never saw his real father. It don't bother me at all though. Yeah. Say it don't bother me at all. They got me thinking about my mom. No, man, I can't wait to sing this song. I be like, I be like, hey, don't cry. Some of the best. And most successful people had, as screwed up as it is, had their parents abandon them. Look at Eminem. He went from nothing to being worth over 300 mil. That's another motivational story right there. And the thing is, is, the thing is, is these bad things that happened to these people made them who they are. They wouldn't be who they are if they didn't have these things happen to them. And they put it into their work. Let's go. Oh no, Cause we ain't got to worry about the money no more We ain't got to worry how the bills get paid We ain't got to worry how the meals get fed Don't cry, hey, oh no Cause we ain't got to worry about the money no more We ain't got to worry how the bills get paid We ain't got to worry how the meals get fed Hey, hey, hey J. Cole reassuring his mom he's going to take care of her. Now he has more than enough money to take care of her. She never has to worry about bills or or or, or trying to get food again. And he mentioned many times in his music that that was a constant struggle with him. So major shout out to J. Cole. Major shout out to J. Cole. Um, and stay tuned. I have 
more videos coming and I will get to some more requests. I, I've been trying to get to everyone, but I promise I will get to you as well. So don't forget to hit subscribe, like, and share.